A large provision to come out of the health care reform law affects dependent eligibility. Beginning September 23, 2010, insurance companies will be required to offer dependent coverage for children up to the age of 26. This applies to all individual and group policies that offer dependent coverage. It means that young people between the ages of 18 and 26 who may have previously been dropped from their parents' plan will now have extended coverage. For example, this will cover recent college graduates who might have otherwise gone without coverage until their first job. So let's take Sarah, who was 24 and finished grad school. Before the health care reform law, Sarah's dependent eligibility was set to expire when she graduated. But now she will be able to remain on her parents' plan while she looks for a job. Keep in mind, if health insurance is provided through an employer, the cost of a dependent's coverage will still be excluded from taxable gross income. And this means that when parents add a dependent to their health policy, his or her coverage will remain tax-free. Now, there are some exclusions to the provision. To qualify as a dependent, the child cannot have a coverage option through their current employer. So if Sarah gets a job at Bob's Retail and Bob's Retail offers her insurance, then Sarah would not be allowed to remain on her parents' policy. Also, this will not extend coverage to the child of an individual receiving dependent coverage. This means that if a dependent has a child of their own, they will have to purchase a separate policy. So if Sarah is on her parents' insurance and she has a baby, Sarah is covered, but her baby is not. She will have to purchase a separate policy to cover him. As we all sort through the details and learn about these changes, we hope this information has been helpful to you. You can find more information on this and other provisions on the Department of Health and Human Services website at dhhs.gov.